The Computer Center for Visually Impaired People at Baruch College, City University of New York, product demonstration. Hello again, it's Gus Chalkius with the computer, from the Computer Center for Visually Impaired People, and we're back with another product demonstration. Today, I'm, I'm once again here with Lynette Tatum, our senior instructor. Hey. Hi, Lynette. <laughs> and um, today we're going to be looking at um, the BookSense, the, uh, which is a portable book reader, daisy player, right? Yes, from daisy GW device Micro. device from GW Micro, and <clears throat> Lynette's going to tell you a little bit more about it. Okay. Now, uh, this is a smaller device, as you can tell. It's very sleek. It, out of the case, it's, it's pretty light, actually. Uh, this version is the advanced version. It's called the XT version. I think it's XT for the extras that are a part of this. Mm. Uh, you have a radio, 4 gig of memory, and Bluetooth capability. I have a, a Bluetooth headset at home that I can listen to so that I can put it you know, on the table and... I, it's hands free. Cool. Okay, <clears throat> the power, just to go over briefly, the. Kind of looks like a cell phone. It does, mm -hmm. it does. I was hoping you'd mention that. Yeah. And we have the play pause here. We have um, the record button here, hold switch here, flip it down, it's in hold, flip it up, it's not in hold. Is that on the left side, the right it is, side? And this is the, well, I guess what would be, if you're holding it, your right side. Uh, okay. if it's If it's the face is facing you. Yeah. As you come on down, you have the um, USB connector. You then have the AC adapter, card slot, yet um, again SD, volume up and down, and mode switch. You have uh, something that <coughs> people wanted and got, the time. This, this was a big thing for folks. So it gives you the time. And then you have the directional arrows with a menu key on the uh, in the middle. Underneath that, there's in fact, there's a little line that sort of delineates, delineates the mm -hmm. uh, divides, the top from the bottom, which is kind of nice. And then you have a very interesting uh, indent, not indented uh, number pad. Oh, One, yeah. two is, is, has a, is not, a, how would you say this? One is it's indented. Recessed. One is recessed, right. two is not recessed, right. three mm -hmm. is re recessed, right. four, and so forth. Mm -hmm. Okay, everyone, almost like a checkerboard. Yeah. Okay. Um, this has a more defined dot on the five, which is nice. And again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, pound, uh, star, um, uh, excuse me, star, zero, pound. Mm -hmm. Turn it on, it makes a lovely sound. Oh, Let's I'm sorry. Yeah. Headphone at the top. External microphone on the other side. And then there's an SD card slot on the. I, I sure showed that. Left. Oh, you did. Okay. Yes, sorry. I, that's all right. There you go. You know, keep me honest. Okay. <laughs> I'm trying. All right. There we go. <laughs> all right. Okay, you have to press the right thing. Okay. Now, one thing now, I didn't get to, to show you. She does. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she does. Yeah. She tells you where you are. You can have all of these features all turned off, you know, but I have them on. It's all right. They're helpful. They're helpful, mm -hmm. exactly. One thing <clears> I didn't <throat> get to show you on the stream is you can check the battery level. And I'm going to press this bottom key, which is the OK key. It is the pound key. Press and hold. Battery level 8. Oh, thank you. Battery level eight. Okay. Uh, now, uh, you can get help for this device by pressing, let's see if I can press and hold the menu button. Help mode enabled. Press the menu button for more than two seconds to exit help mode. Hmm. Excellent. And so if I press a key. Number one. While reading a document, inserts a mark, voice memo, or highlights mark at the current position. Up to 1,000 marks or memos can be inserted. There While in go. the file browser, moves up five items in the file list. And so forth. So it's like a little tutorial. Exactly. Oh, cool. Exactly. That's nice. And you can press any key now on the device and it will tell you what it does. Um, you know, and so that's very helpful. You can get out of that mode. Help mode disabled. Help mode. Document reading info. File name. Surf up start here. HTM. Position. Page one. Three percent reading. Okay. Status paused. Thank you. Status paused. I'm going to press the play button. 
user on the World Wide Web? Do you want to learn how Jaws or Magic can help you navigate the vast resources of entertainment? If I think she's too fast, and you'll notice immediately, I'm certain, the, the voice. This is the famous Neil speech, Kate. And uh, Paul is on this. Um, uh, Paul is her brother, if you will. You can have a male or a female voice. Mm -hmm. Okay, and you can speed her up with the six, put her back to normal with five, and slow her down with four. Let's see what we get. Education and information Four. available on on the web. Surf's up. There you go. Surfing the internet with Jaws and Magic will teach you to use Jaws and Magic to reach the six. I, I oh. just pressed the play oh. and I pressed the 4 to slow her down. Oh, okay. cool. She cannot say internet and she cannot say October. What can I tell you? She says October. So in case you... <laughs> what? She does pronounce things interestingly, and I only mention this because if somebody is reading an article or because you can get uh, a service called Newsline in your pocket for this, that's the New York Times or the Daily News, beware, folks, okay? She has a very pleasant voice, but her pronunciation is sometimes suspect. But uh, our many <laughs> speech well, synthesizers. She does a pretty good job, though. She ha she's she does. very pleasant. Yes. See, I said I, yeah. did, I was positive yes, first. Yes, yes. Okay. <laughs> Now, let's go through what you can do with Miss Kate here. I'm going to press the mode button. Radio. And study and stuff. You know, you ask questions. This is a radio? This is a radio. You know, how did Al Pacino I like this work? You or what was it navigate. like to be with Marlon Brando? And um, she would recount stories to, to me. and to station uh, station, you know where you are on the dial. Correct. with a lot of radios, it's very difficult for somebody who's blind to navigate the dials. Totally, and you can set presets. Mm -hmm. I happen to have NPR as my preset for number one. Nice. Okay, I pressed mute. On the other series, and you didn't intend oh, to go into acting show. until you were okay, spotted we're and asked to audition again. and media. Nice reception. Yes. Audiobooks folder, one of six. Audiobooks folder, and down arrow. Mm -hmm. Miss Audio folder, Miscellaneous two of six. auto audio, please excuse me, for <laughs> miscellaneous auto for longer files, longer MP3 or other uh, audio format files. Music folder, Music three of six. self-explanatory, really. Podcasts folder, Podcasts, four of six. More audio. Radio folder, and five radio. of six. Record folder, six now, of six. believe it or not, one of the lovely features, that interview we just heard uh, on Fresh Air, we can record onto this device oh. and um, and it's stored in that radio folder record folder radio folder that's that five folder. of six and if you go down record folder six of six that's what stores your just your basic recordings that you make with the record button okay this device yes so for those of us who had cassette recorders or radios with cassette players at some point, it's like recording with a cassette. That is correct. Cool. Yeah. Very nice. And it records it in great quality. Um, okay. So let's just talk briefly about how to Radio, navigate folder, here. Radio, folder, podcast, And let's folder, go back to music. Music, folder, three of six. Okay. I'm going to press the right arrow. Far Out Recordings, Brazilian Music Sampler, folder, okay. one of three. Brazilian Music Sampler. Nice. Now... Oh, thank you. <laughs> if I want to play the entire album, I'll press play. Ode 6, Depois du Carnival. Well, she's doing something else. But she's doing it. There you go. Very cool. Oh my gracious, help us. We can pause it. Oh my gracious. Let's see if we can go forward and back. That's nice. Oh wait, power ride. You gotta give me that. Left arrow. Oh five. Bring Hondo de Samba. Eu vou brincando no meu samba vó. Porque tem brasileiro para. Now let's see if I have. <laughs> he is just always ready, folks, to dance. Yeah, I, do. I do love the music. <laughs> so, now I think I might have this on shuffle. Let's see. I'm going to press the nine and hold it. Shuffle play off. Oh, there. I thought so. When I didn't hear it, you know, starting at one, I knew something was a little oh. interesting. Okay, so you can have shuffle mode on or off nice. um gracious there are so many things you can do with this i uh let's let's look daisy and see what, oh, book share I one knew. of four okay daisy they've actually supplied um some folders you know suggested folders book share 
NFB Newsline, NFB, 2 of 4. NFB, as I mentioned before, newspapers. NLS, 3 of 4. NLS. And RFB and D, 4 RFB of 4. And D. This supports them all. I'm going to return to NLS. NLS, 3 of 4. I'm going to press right arrow. Lethal Legacy, an Lethal. Alexandra Cooper mystery. 1 of 3. 1 of 3, down arrow. Journey of a Thousand Miles, my story. 2 of 3. This is by the famous pianist Long Long. Okay, and if you start playing. Loading. It says loading, you wait for a bit. Makes a little Journey beeping. of a Thousand there Miles, my story, by Long Long. With David Ritz. Okay, now DB navigation. I'm, I'm going to press the right arrow while he's yakking. This book contains 239 pages. Approximate right reading time, 7 hours, seven 45 hours, minutes. Lovely. Direct access to the table of contents, okay. introduction, I'm going to use the up and, and down arrow. At level time interval, 5 seconds. You can go by 5 seconds. Chapters, hmm. Beginning or end of book. You can go to the beginning two. or end of the book. Heading. By heading is the most common. Library of Congress I'm annotation. going to press the right arrow now. Contents. Contents. Introduction. Introduction. Oh, nice. Part one. Yes. Revolution. There you go. Tom and Jerry. <laughs> okay. Caption. I love Tom and Jerry. I know. I love comic books. And he loves comic and books. Awesome. <laughs> Press pause. There you go. Um, I think I've gone through. Document reader. Yeah, document, document reader. Document, document reading info. Yeah. File document? name. Surf yeah, up start here. HT. Read and work with all <laughs> types of. Does this one do all? Does this one do different formats, or is is it also limited? Um, does it do doc? It does doc. Okay. It does DOCX. Oh, it does. Which is okay. the, the 07. Right. Uh, this does many, if not most, mm -hmm. of the formats. Totally. It even does Audible Enhanced. Very cool. Okay, so the the difference is this, as I said, is the XT, mm -hmm. and there's a there's a standard version. The difference being. No 4 gig of storage, no radio, and no Bluetooth. For This is almost $500 at, at uh, $499. Okay. The standard, or I think it's called the standard version, right. is, a pr is comparable to the uh, Victor Reader stream at about $359, somewhere in there. Okay. okay? And this is uh, available through GW Micro. GW, GW Micro, Micro. yes. Okay. okay. Well, thanks, there you Lena. Go. You're welcome. Okay. That's the uh, GW Micro Book Sense. And um, we'll be back with more soon. Yeah. Thanks. The CCVIP demos are funded in part by the Aileen Royce Memorial Trust, New York Community Trust, and Reader's Digest Partners for Sight Foundation. Visit us at www.baruch.cuny.edu slash ccvip.